Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is Ashley. I'm in my living room, so hopefully the volume's okay. Also, like, kind of got a weird situation here, but I'm on my couch just chilling. Um, Corey is out running errands, so it gives me the opportunity to do some filming while I'm here alone. Um, and I have my bin here of my project use it up stuff. It's already downstairs, so I figured it would just be easier to keep it down here. Um, this bin is really dirty. It needs to be cleaned out. There was literally a, I picked it up and there was a spider in here and I literally freaked out. I think it was already dead, but I'm still kind of paranoid about it. <laughs> I removed him from the container, but I literally picked it up. I was like, Oh my God, <laughs> I almost dropped it. So I'll be honest. I haven't been doing the best at using up these products. I think I'm going to like come back a little bit and maybe pull you guys in closer. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, then I can like chill on the couch. So I haven't been doing like the best using these things up. I've made progress on some of them, but I'll be honest, like it really hasn't been at the forefront of my mind. Um, some things just naturally I've been using, but like it's been a struggle with like the moisturizers and even some of the sprays, that's for sure. I've just been like not doing very well. So let's maybe just start. I don't really have these things in like pairs necessarily, but let's start with the shower stuff because I think I've been doing the best on the shower stuff. Um, first off, I have, this is my Bath and Body Works project pan. I don't know if I said that. Also, I never did a two week update. So this is just a one month update. I apologize. It just time got away from me. So what do you do? But I'm going to mark stuff right here live on camera for you. This is my Sunset Glow. And I don't know if you can tell, we have made a little bit of progress there. I'm going to mark it. I'm so happy that you can see where this is at now. Because back when I was using this last year, it's like more opaque up here and you couldn't see through it. So I've used some of this. I'm so excited. I really enjoyed this scent for this time of year. However, I don't know what kind of scrub this is. It just says glowing body scrub. It's not very scrubby. Like the quality of it being a scrub is like low. <laughs> like I think it's more of the aesthetic of it and being like having glitter in it than actually like scrubbing your body. So just FYI, if you're like a really, like you're really into scrubs, you're a scrub person, maybe don't buy the glowing body scrubs just because they're not, I don't want to say not that legit, but like they're not very scrubbing, if that makes sense. So next for the shower, I'm working on my Scentsy Go Go Mango body wash. And let me mark this, but I've been doing really good on this bad boy. Look at that. This is like the one thing I've been using consistently. Uh, like all the shower stuff is like, I use it because it's in the shower. Everything else is like a struggle. So I feel like I've been doing really good with that. That marking wasn't necessarily very good there. Um, but I would think maybe like a good month, maybe a little over, this will be done. So because the bottle gets like wider, I don't know that all the progress might not look the same. And then I also have this big kahuna body wash I'm working on. It's the Equate value size cool moisturizing and look at this progress. I think literally because this has a pump, I love using it. It's just so simple to like pump out. I use it all the time. And so I've been using these together. Like I'll use this and then I'll use this. So I think that's really helped. Okay, let's move on to the non shower items that aren't looking so hot. So I'm using these two, right? Um, no, 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 no. I'm using these two kind of together. So one's the vanilla bean, which I was working on last year. I didn't use this one at all. I just realized. Okay. And then I have the agave papaya sunset spray. This literally I used one time, I think. It's like not, I'm trying to put it flat so I mark it like accurately. Oh gosh, you guys. That's bad. <laughs> That's really bad. That's not good progress whatsoever. Yikes. But like I said, I haven't just really been using these very good, but that's why I do these videos because it kind of kicks me in the butt to be like, let's get going. 
And then the next little set I'm using together, the first one is the Dream in the Sky. This one I actually have some progress on, so way to go. The top lines kind of fall off. Look at that progress. This is the spray, I like it. That's okay, that's decent. And then the cream I haven't, I've used a couple times, but it's not like marked or anything. It's pretty yellow. I don't know if you guys remember from the last video, like can you tell how like yellow and brown it's looking? It's pretty bad. So um, because I initially thought this was like really turning, so I was using it. And the first couple times I used it, I was like, it kind of smells like, plasticky and like gross so I was like okay should I just stop using it like is it really gone off to the point where it's like not good for me to use it and I was like I'm just gonna try it one more time because I really love this scent and I like didn't want to part with it but I was like if it's bad it's bad like flat out so I was like okay I'll just use it on my legs one more time as a test run and see what happens and I used it that time and I don't know if I just as I work my way through the bottle, like that first initial bottom layer was like grody, but it was definitely a lot better that time. So I don't know, it didn't have that weird like plastic gone off smell. It was like the actual smell of the product. So I'm gonna continue probably making this set my primary focus just because of this, but that's kind of the story with this. If you guys have this, have you experienced kind of the same thing? Like, do you still have it? Is it in your like collection? Like if you collect Bath and Body Works somewhere, pull it out because mine's really yellow and it's only from last spring. I mean, it's kind of the same as these other sets that I have in here. It's not that old. So I don't know, it's kind of weird. Uh, but to be expected because it's like marshmallow is like essentially the scent of it. It's lavender and marshmallow, oh, whipped vanilla. It's like marshmallow lavender. Sugared lavender, honey butter, and whipped vanilla. It says the notes are. It's like very sweet. Um, and then I also have the Frosted Coconut Snowball Body Lotion. I have worked on this. However, I don't... This is the current update. This was from before. I don't know that I'm really... It's maybe like here. Like, I probably used it once. <laughs> Um, so I probably need to focus on that a little bit more. <coughs> okay. And then the last set, I think I only used this set also one time, is my margarita cupcake. So let's mark this. E, Yikes. And this lid pisses me off. Look how crooked it is. Like, ugh. It just, it won't, however it is, it just won't connect so if I finish up another lotion I'll probably replace the lid because it drives me mad uh same with the body cream I think I only used it once I'll be honest I don't I the scent is good but it's not as good as I remember it and I should have just used it up when I when I bought it I'm like figuring that out that's why I haven't bought any body care because I'm like I have so much to go through and it's best when you if you just use it when you buy it <laughs> really kicking myself um and this spray I hardly used also so you can tell where my focus was which is okay because I did really want my focus to be on the dream in the sky stuff because the sprays I have two more sprays like I'm not concerned about this um I thought I had another lotion but for some reason I only found this one I think but I thought I bought two. So I don't really know exactly what the situation is or if I knew it was going off. So maybe I put one in my Poshmark pile. I still need to post all my Poshmark stuff for my clear out. I might be adding more to it because like I said, I have a ton of body care and just the rate that this stuff is going bad. I really need to kick it in gear and use it up if I'm going to truly use it up and not like end up having to get rid of it. So that's what I have for my Bath and Body Works project update. I may continue to do these monthly. I don't really know. It'll probably just depend what my schedule is like, but I think seeing this progress monthly for some products, I'm like, wow, I did really good versus only two weeks. Other products, I'm like, <clears throat> wow, I only got that much use out of a whole month. And like, the vanilla bean, I didn't even use it all. So I think having this little container though with the variety of products in my actual bathroom has helped. 
but it is on the floor and so I think sometimes when I'm in a rush I'm like okay gotta go and I don't even look at the basket so I'm trying to get better about it but that's why we do these projects right to like bring light to the fact that we need to use things up so thank you so much for spending the last 10 minutes with me babble about body care and using it up I hope you guys are doing well in your project use it ups thank you so much for hanging out and chatting with me I'll see you next time